Good evening and welcome back, or indeed just welcome if you're new to the channel. Highlights of three games today, starting with a semi-final Copa del Rey tie against Atletico Madrid. Can Malaga get to yet another final? The match today being played at a neutral ground, the Camp Nou Stadium. What a beautiful ground this is. And it's an early start as we retain possession from the kickoff. The ball works its way to Pedri, who unleashes a 20-yard strike. What a finish. Pedri back at the ground where he made his name. What a start. Madrid cannot get a foot in the game. Malaga absolutely dominating possession. And on 15 minutes, a neat 1-2 between Castro and Martinelli leads to us doubling our lead. The passes are flowing in this game. On the counter-attack now, after a rare foray forward from Atletico Madrid, Castro thwarted by Oblak. Then on the 28-minute mark, out of nowhere, Madrid find themselves back in the game. A fine strike from Correa. That joy is short-lived though, another fine move, straight from the kickoff. Diaby finding Castro, who fires in off the post. Another great team move by Malaga. Jao Felix with a chance now, but it's a weak effort straight at Schubert. Clearly Atletico's team talk had no impact at all. Gavardio breaking up play and setting up the counter. Castro and Martinelli combining once again and the captain with his second of the night. Kieran Trippier trying his luck from distance but it's easily dealt with. And the Selkie passes continue, Martinelli looking for his hat-trick, but he's not able to bend it around all black. And this time it's Castro's turn to be thwarted by the keeper, what a great save that is. From the resultant corner, Koslu almost gets a rare goal, but again all black reacts well. Messi on as a sub now, flying down the right wing, and he puts in a great ball to Martinelli. What a cheeky finish that is, and what a great way to get his hat-trick. Messi turns creator once again, but how did Oblak save that one? He's unlucky though, as Pedri is there to tap in the rebound. What a world class save that was though, very unlucky. Atletico clearly shell shocked now, Trippier sliding in Martinelli, who has four on the night. Then absolute chaos on the Malaga defence, Gavardio loses the ball carelessly. But it looks like Schubert has this covered. Well, what's he doing now? He loses the ball and Jimenez for some reason decides to chip it in with an open goal. That could have been one of the misses of the season. Sloppy from Malaga though. And that's how the game finished. A nine goal game and a dominating display from Malaga. A four goal masterclass from our captain. And it's a final tie versus Real Madrid. Should be a classic. Back in the Champions League now, a quarter-final tie at Anfield, the first leg against Liverpool. 
some very tired bodies out there after an international call up for many of our players. And possibly that international call up has affected our players. Malaga off to a sluggish start. Some slack defending leads to Gabriel Jesus capitalising. It's 1 0 to the Reds. Malaga getting back into the game a little bit more now. Mariba trying his luck, but again, Alisson's a match. And on the stroke of half time, it's a chance for Messi but it's a team effort and that's it for the first half. We're really struggling to get back into this one. A positive start in the second half, more fluency in our passing. Castro finds Mudrick, but he fails to hit the target. We've got to make the most out of these chances. Finding our form towards the hour mark and a flow move finally pays off. Vieira finding Castro who makes no mistake from 12 yards out. golden chance to take the lead but Martinelli can't hit the target. Chances have been at a minimum that could come back to bite Malaga but with only minutes to go Vieira puts a beautiful ball down the line to Diaby. The winger squares it to Castro who silences the home crowd from 15 yards taking a lead right at the death. Martinelli nearly makes it three, a beautiful pass from Castro, but Alisson reacting well. And from the resultant corner, the goalkeeper saves from a Cossonu header. Liverpool looking for the full-time whistle right now. Castro turns playmaker again. A great first touch from Giorbi, and with the last skip of the game, the forward makes it three. A massive moment in the tie, the Liverpool players absolutely devastated. Castro getting man of the match, deservedly so, a tough match for Malaga but in great shape to get through to the semi-finals. Back at home in the league for our final match of the episode, a match against Celta de Vigo who are fighting to get into the top six, and Messi's coming back into the team playing up front rather than on his usual right wing position. And Nelly the perfect start for the region, hitting the woodwork after some great play from the front line. On the half hour mark Messi finds himself through again but he's denied by the keeper. And just a few more minutes later the Argentinian fails to hit the target, he could have had a hat trick already. Just before half time we'll have a free kick from 40 yards out. Hugo Malo seems to have it covered, but a massive mistake from the defender, and Martinelli capitalises and taps in to take the lead. And it's just not Messi's day today, missing once again, very much not myself. Substitutes Modric and Castro combine and finally we get that second goal. Less than 20 minutes to go and is the misfiring bug catching? Castro missing the target from close range. Malaga keeping the pressure on late in the game, Modric wins the ball high up the pitch Castro firing in after neat 1 2 with Xerxes. And that was pretty much the last kick of the game.
substitute Castro with a man of the match cameo. And that's all for today, some big matches coming up including the second leg tie against Liverpool in the Champions League. As always, thank you for joining once again and I'll see you all next time. Cheers.